What's up, folks? I'm G here. Just an update on my tours. I did a video, Taurus vs. Sky. They're both great guns. But I kind of recommended the Taurus. So this is just an update on that. So, here's my Taurus. If I can get it. There we go. Here's the update on it. So I got the 709 Slim Mag. I do a little bit of altering on the lips. Just to make the round slide in. Took it to the range, no problems. Then I bought this mount with this crane dot. Oh, whoa, let me tell you. This crane dot is clean, clean, clean. Look at that bad boy. Oh, yeah. I had to cut out my. Um, holster something the green dot would fit but that was nothing but one of the reasons why you should go with the Taurus and not the sky there we go is because if you wanted a red dot or green dot on your sky you can't get it you can but you have to buy a whole new slide and then it comes mounted on, and you're gonna have an extra slide. No reason. It's a 10 round extended mag, 709 slim. So it doesn't really go to this gun, but it works. I took it to the range and I had no feeding issues, nothing. Thing shot like a champ. Did some color filling. I couldn't make a video on that, but there's so many on out there that there's no need. All you put in color filling and on your pistol and it'll come up. But man, let me tell you. That's one clean looking pistol. I think she fires smoother than the sky too. You also got this rail. Sure pretty sure it's a Pekingese rail. I could be wrong, but yeah, I put a laser on there. I didn't really like it. So I think I'm going to try a flashlight. But that's why I went with the, the sight. But man. But there's some updates on my tours. I had to buy this mount right here. But then you can buy any mount. Or you can buy the mount and put any sight on there. Any optic. So, just one more reason why you should go with Taurus instead of the Sky. So, that's just the updates on those. Man, that looks mean. Well, Alright, everyone. Y'all have a good one. And then, until next time.